When God wants to do a mighty work in a nation, when he wants to bring about transformation and change, when he wants to turn the heart of a people, he will begin by engaging his people to pray. Yes, God is sovereign and he does as he pleases, but he has designed it so that our prayers fit into and are a part of his plan. So when God wants to shake the nations, wake them up and draw them to his side, he will first motivate his people to pray. And when he does, our prayers move the muscles of Almighty God to perform miracles amongst us. And this is why I hope you will join me and all of us at Johnny and Friends in preparing for the upcoming National Day of Prayer, the first Thursday of May. Psalm 33 verse 12 says, Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. And I know you join me in desiring to see our country make the God of the Bible the Lord of our land. So may I encourage you to get your friends involved. If you know of a National Day of Prayer observance in your community, then by all means, make plans with your friends and family to attend. You can locate that National Day of Prayer observance near you by visiting the website of the National Day of Prayer. And if you cannot locate an observance, then uh, hey, start planning one right now. Perhaps your Bible study can convene to lift up our nation in prayer on that first Thursday in May, or maybe your book club, or the women's or men's group in your church, or your college and career class. Or how about asking your neighbors to come over to your house for coffee and a time of prayer for the United States of America? The National Day of Prayer Task Force has all sorts of resources for you to make it a special time of praise and intercession. Because I believe, I, I'm convinced, I, I know that revival is on the horizon for America, but it will take our prayers to bring it into reality. So let's lift up the President of our United States and his administration. Let's pray for the members of the United States Congress and our state assemblies. Let's pray for our municipalities and the U.S. courts, both state and federal. Pray for the name of God to be exalted in the media, in arts and entertainment, in business, medicine, and education, and in every home across our nation. Let's work with God. Let's partner with Him. Let's, let's fit into His grand and glorious strategy to bring about revival in our land. I hope you're as excited as I am about the National Day of Prayer. Visit the NDP website or the Johnny and Friends blog here on our website to learn more. Exalt the name of Jesus. Make God famous among your friends, family, and co-workers. Point people to the Lord, because oh my goodness, revival is on its way. On behalf of all of us here at the Johnny and Friends International Disability Center and the National Day of Prayer Task Force, let's get praying.